2 Corinthians chapter 7 Promises we have Verse 1 Therefore, since we have these promises, dear friends, let us purify ourselves from everything that contaminates body and spirit. Perfecting holiness out of reverence for God. Promises bring peace and hope. They bring joy even if they have not yet been fulfilled. Depending on who made the promise, the magnitude of peace, hope, and joy varies. If the promise is made by someone we truly trust and who has the ability to fulfill it, the hope and joy that the promise brings will be immeasurable. The one who made the promise that Paul speaks of is God. He is not our neighbor, friend, or colleague, but our creator. He is the God who sacrificed his own son to save us. He is the God who, unmatched in power by anyone in the world, loves us and makes promises to us. He promises to dwell within us, to be our father, and to adopt us as his children. The Holy God is with us. He is our Father. We are His children. Imagine that the Holy God, our Father, is with you right now. Wouldn't fear and joy arise simultaneously? Would it be possible to have evil thoughts, words, and actions? We are God's children who have His promises. We must strive to live a life befitting God's children. God, your promise that you are with me, that you are my father, and that you have adopted me as your child, brings hope and joy. Help me live a life as your child, distinguished by holiness from the world. Holy Spirit, guide me in truth, 